Hello and welcome here with me, Ziad Snusi, to another uh, video in digital control. Uh, we need to investigate this uh, sampled uh, data digital system and we need to know if there exists uh, a transfer function for the system, for this open loop system, for this open loop system, uh, and find if there's uh, an output function. Of course, there's an output function, but we need to investigate if there's a transfer function or not. Okay, so we know the, we have two samples here, samplers here. Uh, they are sy synchronized with the sampling time t, okay, or switches you can say. And uh, we have two transfer functions here in Laplace form, g1 of s and g2 of s, and we have the output signal is c of s, and the input signal here is e of s. Okay, okay. So after the sampling here we know the the e of s is being sampled so we have e star of s sorry so we got e star of s sampled of s and we will name this uh, signal here for example it's a of s and it will be sampled so it will be a star of s it's being sampled here okay and we have c of s okay now e star of s sorry a of s will be equal to E star of s times g1 of s. Okay, if we take the sampling for this signal, a star of s, because here it's being sampled, we need to know this a star. We need to know this. So a star of s will sample this form, which is e star of s and g1 of s all star. And this, because this is already been sampled, so there's no need to sample it again. So just now, like now. And this g1 of s will be star. Okay. Okay. Now c of s will be equal to a star of s times g2 of s. Okay. If we take c star of s now, the same like this one, a star of s times g2 of s, all being sampled. So a of s it's already sampled. There's no need to be sampled again and g2 star of s sampled now okay now we substitute this equation here this a of s this one into here into this okay so we got c star of s will be equal to e star of s g1 star of s times times g2 star of s okay we know this one is the input and this one is the output so as you can see e of s e star of s is input and uh, c star of s will be output if there's a fictitious sampler here so we have a c star of s we need to know if there exists a transfer function or not yes and this one if you take the z transform now so cz will be equal to e of z times g1 of z times g2 of z okay so the transfer function for this digital transfer form will be c of z over u of z <coughs> and it's equal to g1 of z times g2 of z okay so we have a nice form here z transform digital form so we have the transfer function is existing there's no um, there's some forms the transfer function is not existing and we'll see later in other videos other forms that the transfer is not existing okay and all cases uh, the output function is existing c of s or c star of s always is existing like this one here like this one here but sometimes as i said transfer function, transfer function in digital form it's, maybe it's not existing okay i hope this video is, uh, will be helpful for you guys if you have any uh, questions please leave it in the comments section below and thank you for watching. See you next time.